What's up, guys? It's your boy MP with another MP Talks. I'm gonna chill a little bit on this podcast. We're actually gonna be changing this name. Just simple, the MP Podcast. Pretty simple, right? We're gonna go episode one, two, three, and four. It's gonna be episode one. We're just gonna talk about things, man. We're gonna talk about what we're gonna do. We're gonna talk about people we like. We're gonna talk about people we don't like. So obviously, there's no topic on that. Um, but if you guys don't know who I am, make sure you check out twitch.tv slash Madden's Players. You can hit that, that follow button on that one. Hit the subscribe button on this video right here. But if you guys don't know who I am, let's let's just chat a little bit, guys. Because we're going to be doing a lot of big things now that we uh, got established where we are. And we're going to start streaming again on the regular. And especially with Madden 22 drops, we're definitely going to be on a lot trying to make clubs. Trying to give you guys the best entertainment that there is. Now, the thing about me is... You understand I'm not I'm not like a top streamer I don't have a whole bunch of stuff I'm just a, you know just a dad you know what I mean chilling and stuff and we're just having a good time trying to grow this as a hobby I don't do this for a living I don't live off this I just like to you know entertain and have fun so if we ever talk about stuff just know that you know it's all in fun right all right so for those that don't know who I am we'll start from base one um some of you guys might know me from Kelly Swags hot seat me and kelly has had some words and we've had some i don't want to call it beefs because i think we're pretty cool it, we've, we've talked we've been in each other's streams and stuff it's more of a healthy rivalry i guess if you want to call it but he's doing some big things with the hot seat right here if you guys do not know what the hot seat is you want to go watch this stuff this is it right here this is his channel or excuse me that's his twitter that's the channel right there kelly swag king with an a one in it and you can watch all the episodes right here um and he's, he's got a few i believe where were we right here right right here so 220 220 views on, on on the podcast it was good um i love to be on it again um but for those that don't don't know when we were on kelly's hot seat we had a lot of things to say and we went off on a lot of people and we felt the way about it. We don't need to get back into that or anything. But we we were just a different person at that time. Um, and I feel that a lot of people misjudged me, misunderstood me. And even myself, when I was in the interview, we got, uh, you know, a little carried away and stuff. But that's here to say. But I really, you know, I want to be on the, the hot seat again and actually answering some of the questions, you know, with a little more verata and a little more impact about what I wanted to say, what I want to say. But... If you guys follow me already, and you got my Twitter, which is at Madden's Players. The S's are Z's, M A G D E N Z P L A Y E R Z. You guys know I'm just having fun and being legit and whatever I do, right? So go check him out, man. He streams pretty much about uh, at night. I'd say around 11, 11 ish Pacific Standard Time at night. So if you like need an overnight streamer to watch, it's pretty fun. He does Madden. He plays uh, Call of Duty. He does some other stuff. I think he even, for some of his subs sometimes, he does some WWE Royal Rumbles. So, you know, he has a lot of fun stuff for you guys. You can go check him out. He's he's a cool dude. Um, if you don't know me from there, I do make a lot of club championships. Um, let me rephrase that. Um, I have never made a club final. I've never been on TV with the clubs, but I have made the brackets. Uh Everyone knows the story already about what happened with this last Madden, whatever. But we're going to take that. We're going to shove it to the side. And we're going to go really hard this time. I'll have a lot more time to dedicate to it. Um, we already pre-ordered the game, obviously. So we're definitely going to be doing that. You guys are going to see a lot of that. So if you guys don't know, Career Gamer got the spot over me this year. Um, shout out to Career Gamer, man. Good guy. <laughs> and here's where some people really got to kind of know me and I'm going to put that in quotes, is Derwin versus the world. They did a little clip, you know, clip us, and we'll put you up there. And at the time, I thought I was riding high. I was getting some notoriety. I was getting some stuff. I was I was very kind of happy that when they put it on there. And, uh, you know, it just kind of dwindled and it never happened. So some of you guys know me from that and try to get to know me and stuff like that. And if that's where you know me from, I hope and pray and truly hope that you come into my streams and hang out with us, especially on the Saturday night extreme nights. We've been doing them Friday lately, but Saturday nights are normally the ones that I like to do it on. Um, basically, we just, you know, have a few drinks, you know, 21 and older, obviously. Um, 
play some Madden Weekend League, and there's a whole bunch of rules that we play with and stuff, and it just makes it a lot of entertaining, a lot of engagements and stuff. Also, if you ever watch me stream, every sub that we get, we actually do spike the ball. You can go watch one of my latest videos if, if you're watching this recently, and you'll see that we did 10 to 15 spikes one time. Man, I was it was a workout. We, we have a lot of fun in stream, right? And then um, here's here's one of the new chats that I've been in. And though I haven't been in there recently a lot, um, I've been noticing that, you know, Fendler is definitely a cat that's here to stay for a while. I actually met this cat um, from when I've been watching Cat because we watch uh, Kep a lot. That's probably where some of you know me from because I was in this chat and stuff. Kep's, Kep's, Kep's a character. You know, he's he's definitely not for everyone. <laughs> He's not a one size fits all, but he is a good dude. I like to watch him. He's fun to watch when he's on. Um, but um, with Fender, I feel like I don't know him and me kind of connected. If you watch Kelly Swag's interview, he did actually um, address. I won't say address him, but Kelly Swag asked him how he felt about me. And and I'll be honest, there's some f few people out there that will actually give you a sour opinion of me, and that's just because they don't know. They don't see the, the passion I have for Madden or the community. And so a lot of the stuff that I say might come out wrong, right? See, see, here's, here's the thing that Finn gets. Maybe I don't want to be a million-dollar streamer. I don't want to be all, all about that, right? It'd be cool. It'd be cool. But, you know, I don't have the chops for that. I'm not built for that. I'm not built for an audience of five to the thousand yet, right? <laughs> and stuff but he sees the passion that i have for the game the community what i want it to be and what i want it to grow to and that's what i think attracts fan over here is he sees me you know this person working nine to five doing stuff for the kids for the wife and i'm still trying to put time in for the community and make it fun and better and when i see stuff that i don't i don't want to say don't like or i feel that i can do better in, then i feel a certain way about it <laughs> and stuff though i may not be ready for madden live and stuff of course i want it it's clear that i, that I want it if you don't want madden live you're just lying to yourself because that's giving you more exposure more viewers more stuff you know and you have all those people in chat that's why we stream we want all those people in chat to talk to to build with to build a community with so though madden live may not happen tomorrow this year or whatever it's definitely a goal i definitely want to build towards and get to know and everything like that but I always say you got to be able to offer something to Madden Live. You can't just be like, it can't be Madden Live pulling you up. You have to be able to pull the game up. You have to have something to give them to call to make them call you up. You know stuff like that. So that's one thing we definitely stepped back. We were working on um, over the past. I want to say three or four months. I really totally changed my direction of what, of how we stream, what we stream. Um, I just like to have fun with the game, whether I win or lose currently right now, doesn't really matter and stuff. It will later, but for now, we just, we just gonna have fun, that's all. Um, 22 edition coming out. So we already pre-ordered it, we already got everything set. We're gonna go crazy in about this year. We're gonna, like I said, we're gonna go Raiders Club. We're gonna try and make it. Um, a lot of people go, why do you pick some, some, you know, like you can't beat Pava. Why do you pick the Raiders Club? Well, here's the thing, man. You're eventually going to have to beat someone, no matter what club you're in. I don't care if the Lions, 49ers, uh, Dolphins, whatever. It doesn't matter. Everyone is gonna have to face someone at the end if you want to be the champion. So I'm not gonna be afraid of playing Pavin or any other big name streamer. Excuse me, or a big name pro. Cause that's how you improve, man. Sometimes you gotta get in there, you gotta get your butt kicked, and that's just what it's about, and stuff like that. So, you know, that's why I'm gonna stay through with the Raiders one, go through, see if I can make it, and you know, you never know, you could get lucky one game or not. So, uh, <clears throat> that's a lot of stuff that we're we're looking forward to this the season, um, the stuff that's coming up. A lot of the questions I've been asked about when I'm going to be streaming because I've been streaming in and out to the days and stuff, not really having a schedule. That was mentioned in Kelly's podcast as well. Um, you know, people aren't going to know you're on if you don't have a schedule. So we will be getting out the schedule to you guys um, by the end of this week, start of next week, once I know my actual real life schedule and how that's going to work. Then it'll probably be, I'm guessing, more night streams. Um, probably... 
11 p.m. Eastern until the finish. So I get tired, especially when football comes around. We're going to be streaming on football nights, uh, Monday, Thursdays, um, Saturday nights, obviously, and stuff because those are the major ones. And then here or there, depending on what we have. Um, that's pretty much the, the, the major news. Um, I, I know Ke um, Kelly Swag and, and uh, a lot of people ask, at, ask um, the question about <laughs> do, do we care what a lot of people think or you know, do, do I really get all um, up in businesses and stuff about stuff. I just like to have fun, man. None of this stuff translates to real life. No one's buying me like a, a car to, to stream or play people. You know, we're just out here having fun and that's what we're about so i want to encourage you guys to chill with us um the rest of this week we should be on wednesday thursday friday pretty much 10 a.m and, and until we uh have to get off um i want to do this saturday uh it might be friday i gotta look at the schedule either friday or saturday make sure you check the twitter we're gonna do the drunk the drunk stream it's really called mp extreme um twitter is where i post what we do there so make sure you guys check us out on the twitter which is in the which is at madden's players m-a-d-d-e-n-z p-l-a-y-e-r-z and give us a follow there but this is just a quick update of what's going on if you guys have any questions put them in the comments tag me message me whatever and if anyone's ever down to do an interview a hot seat a fender interview Say it, Fender. I'm always down. It can be anyone. You don't have to be Fender or, or, or Kelly. You can be anyone. I'll do most Nostradamus again and stuff. His was really fun. I actually do want to maybe talk to you this, this upcoming season about doing some league crawling tournaments Saturday a.m. I'm not fully sure how we're going to do that yet. But if you're watching this, I do want to get with you and do something cool. I've tried to do it in the past with people, and I just want to talk to you and see how it goes. So make sure you guys check us out, guys. We are going to be doing big things um, in the next coming weeks. We'll be on regularly, and you guys can always see us. Subs are always welcome. I appreciate every single sub. I appreciate every single view. I do ask if you come view us, give us a follow. Give us some love. Tweet us out, and we'll do the same to you. If you come on my stream and you you know hang out with us, I'm definitely going to want to come in your stream. That's one thing I've learned. You definitely want to make sure you follow people that you know are going to come around and give you energy and stuff like that. So that's how we grow. One more viewer a day is what our goal always is. One follower a day, and you know you're always going to be better than you were the day before. And that's the message I like to pass along. And that's pretty much it. Hope you guys have a good night. And as always, baby, it's MP.